We continue today with the workbook of A Course in Miracles. What is the ego? The ego is idolatry, the sign of limited and separated self, born in a body, doomed to suffer and to end its life in death. It is the quote, will, that sees the will of God as enemy and takes the form in which it is denied. The ego is the quote, proof that strength is weak and love is fearful, life is really death and what opposes God alone is true. The ego is insane. In fear it stands beyond the everywhere, apart from all, in separation from the infinite. In its insanity it thinks it has become a victor over God himself. And in its terrible autonomy, it, quote, sees the will of God has been destroyed. It dreams of punishment and trembles at the figures in its dreams, its enemies who seek to murder it before it can ensure its safety by attacking them. The Son of God is egoless. What can he know of madness and the death of God? when he abides in him? What can he know of sorrow and of suffering when he lives in eternal joy? What can he know of fear and punishment, of sin and guilt, of hatred and attack, when all there is surrounding him is everlasting peace, forever conflict-free and undisturbed, in deepest silence and tranquility? To know reality is not to see the ego and its thoughts, its works, its arts, acts, its laws, and its beliefs, its dreams, its hopes, its plans for its salvation, and the cost belief it in, in it entails. In suffering, the price for faith in it is so immense that crucifixion of the Son of God is offered daily at its darkened shrine, and blood must flow before the altar where its sickly followers prepare to die. Yet, will one lily of forgiveness change the darkness into light, the altar to illusions, to the shrine of life itself? And peace will be re restored forever to the holy minds which God created as his son, his dwelling place, his joy, his love, completely his, completely one with him. Lesson 331 There is no conflict, for my will is yours. How foolish, Father, to believe your son could cause himself to suffer. Could he make a plan for his damnation and be left without a certain way to his release? You love me, Father. You could never leave me desolate to die within a world of pain and cruelty. How could I think that love has left itself? There is no will except the will of love. Fear is a dream and has no will that can conflict with yours. Conflict is sleep and peace awakening. Death is illusion. Life, eternal truth. There is no opposite to your will. There is no conflict for my will is yours. Forgiveness shows us that God's will is one and that we share it. Let us look upon the holy sights forgiveness shows today that we may find the peace of God. Amen.